Well, welcome to Vintage Farmhouse Antiques and we're going to run you over this absolutely stunning trio made in the classic English Imari style. This one actually is taking from uh, some older Imari patterns made by Derby and then increasingly produced by Sutherlands. This is a, a copy of that, it's very close to the Sutherlands, made probably during the period somewhere between 1890 and 1914. And the factory mark is one that we've not come across and can't find any details on. There you are, a filled round crown mark. It's A couple of them have got some dots in them, but we can't decipher or find any information about this manufacturer. And that leads me to assume that these were basically being produced because Sutherland were having such success with this design during this period. And the factories around this time would see what their competitors were doing and would start copying their designs, basically. So this is a very close copy of Sutherland Imari style 724 pattern. But this one is produced by a factory in disguise, obviously covering up who they are and just putting a faux crown mark on there with uh, the internal reference for the factory being 1458. A beautiful Victorian style, wide rimmed, open bowl, indent rimmed teacup in beautiful condition, almost a stirrup handle, but it's really a peaked arch, Gothic style, very short stem, and then the round base plate. Antique, definitely. Date range we've discussed, the saucer plate, just look at this, absolutely beautiful. If you compare this to Sutherland 724, you'll see it's almost identical, particularly the cobalt blue infilled with the three flower sections. The orange section varies in not having uh, symmetrical three leaf garlands coming out, but only one leaf coming out on the right aspect. And the aspect of the ratio between the blues and the pale centre portion of this design are reversed. But otherwise you've got these sections around the rim which are almost identical and certainly the colours and gilts. And these are really finely decorated. All the gilts being been hand applied. All the colour has been hand applied. This is basically a transfer basic design that has then been hand decorated. And again matching china marks on the base unknown factory and the tea plate absolutely again beautifully painted hand decoration which is really rich and again the same matching china mark so a beautiful set extremely rare we've not seen anything like it we've done extensive research on this in the period that we've listed these I've only got two of them and one's actually pre-sold, sold overnight before we've actually produced this supporting video. So there's one other trio available. Uh, two collectors, very fine, very beautiful. What a gorgeous collector's piece this is. If somebody is a real fan of Imari China, you're not going to find anything really from this period in such a lovely shape and in such lovely condition. Thanks for watching.